Get your free copy of the complete tutorial at www.teachucomp.com forward slash free. Moving Elements in Photoshop Elements 2023 and later lets you add animation to a selection in a photo. You can then export the animated photo as an MP4 or animated GIF. To add moving elements to a photo in Photoshop Elements, open the photo to which to add the moving element in the photo editor. Then select Enhance, Moving Elements from the menu bar to open the selected photo in the Moving Elements window. You can use the Zoom tool and Hand tool in the toolbar at the left side of the window to zoom and pan the preview image that appears as needed. You can also zoom the image by using the zoom slider towards the upper right corner of the window. The selection and animation options appear in the pane at the right side of the window. To select the elements of the photo to animate, click either the sky, background, or manual button in the right pane. To make a custom selection, if you choose the manual button, or to refine the selection made by clicking either the sky or background button, Click to select the desired selection tool to use by clicking either the Brush, Quick, or Auto button. Then choose either the Add or Subtract Selection Mode button as needed. If needed to set the size of your selection tool, use the Size slider. To show the selection as a mask if desired, check the Show Mask checkbox. Then click and drag in the preview image to add or subtract from the selection as needed. After selecting the elements of the photo to animate, then click the button in the second section towards the bottom of the pane. Then click and drag in the area of the preview image to animate in the direction you want to move the selected pixels in that area of the photo. Then release the mouse button to add a directional arrow to the preview image. To change the speed of the selected arrow's animation if desired, use the speed slider in the pane. If desired, you can repeat this process to draw different arrows in different areas to make multiple areas move in different directions. To delete a directional arrow if needed, click the button in the second section of the pane and then click to select the arrow to delete. Then click the small trash can icon that appears in the center of the arrow when it is selected. To select all directional arrows in the photo if needed, check the Select All checkbox in the pane. To preview the effect in the preview image, click the Play button below the preview image. To pause the effect playback, click the pause button that then replaces the play button at the bottom of the window. To cancel creating the moving elements photo, click the cancel button in the lower right corner of the window to cancel your changes and close the window. Alternatively, to export the results as an MP4 or animated GIF, click the export button. Then, in the Save As dialog box that opens, choose the folder into which to save the animated file, and type a name for it into the File Name field. To select the file type, select either MP4 or GIF from the Save As Type dropdown. Optionally, to include it in the Elements Organizer, check the Include in the Elements Organizer checkbox. Then click the Save button to finish and export the animated file. Like what you see? Pick up your free copy of the complete tutorial at www.teachucomp.com forward slash free.